Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's been a long while because I was busy doing vines. So for today, I'm gonna do again a makeup tutorial for uh, creative makeup for this panda bear. Yes, this one. So for this makeup, I'm going to start with my face and we'll start with uh, cleansing your face using the Bioderma. Always do moisturize yourself. For me, I'm using this Olay. And for the face primer, I'm using this Photo Ready from Revlon. And for the foundation, I'm gonna use this professional makeup from NYX. And since we're doing a panda inspired makeup, uh, we're gonna use a lighter shade of our foundation. that we are aiming for so now let's proceed for the powder set it with the powder from motives Lauren Lindinger Having our brows, I'm using again this LA Girl July Nash 724 brow. And for the eyeshadow, I'm gonna use this color pop uh, palette. For the transition color, I'm gonna use this no to self. And I'm gonna darken this transition color using this NYX product. I'm gonna use this shade. I'm using this Morphe. I'm gonna use this black. So once the base colors are blended together, so that is when I go with the black color and I'm taking it on a smaller brush. And I'm blending it well to make sure that there will be no harsh lines created. I'm gonna put white from the center. Uh, still, I'm using from uh, James Charles.
now for the lipstick, I'm gonna use this black color from iMagic Professional Cosmetics. Black lipstick is a little bit tricky, so be careful when you're aligning your own lips. And I'm gonna put my lashes on. I'm gonna use eyeliner from Lakme Insta Liner and Gosh for my pen nose. I just draw a line using the pencil liner from Gosh and layer on fill it using the Insta Liner from Lakshmi. And I also did contour my face using the black eyeshadow shade from James Charles palette as well as my forehead and my nose just to give you a little bit of depth and illusion. And now for the highlighter, I'm using flower. And I put highlighter to my cheekbone, nose, chin, forehead, the specific parts of my face that I want to pop up. Then that's a complete look for our panda inspired makeup. This is something very easy makeup for a Halloween party or when you are going to a costume party. Then let's proceed to the pictorial 101. Thank you all so much for watching my Panda Inspired Makeup tutorial. If you love it, make sure you give a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you in my next videos. Bye!